I'm Dr. Shay Shay, and welcome to a very special episode of This Is Your Life. Today, on Christmas Day, we will have a very special lady on our show. We are taking her from the grave, using our special illegal technologies, and showcasing her interesting life. Let's see if you can guess our mystery guest. She was born in England. She came here on a ship. It's Mary. <laughs> Not the Jesus kind, though. Coming in like a wrecking ball, it's Mary Way. So you're British? Was British, you mean. And I'm full on gay times and lavingtons. Oh. What was your life like living in England? And what made you want to move to an awful place like Australia? I didn't really have a choice back then. As soon as I was born in the late 1870s, I was spent my life begging on the streets of Westminster, England. I understand that work was scarce in England at the time. Yes, they were, Dr. Shay Shay. I acted out in desperation and stole one cotton frock, one linen cap, and one linen tippet. Previous to this crime, I stripped another child and tried to hide them in a ditch, but I was too young to be prosecuted. We have your court trial here with us today and your resentence papers that declare you to be sent to New South Wales. I'd rather not see that, thank you. It brings back the bad memories. Hot damn, this is getting more interesting by the minute. Now a message from our sponsors. So I see you're into shipping. Mm, yeah, I love ships. Well, do you recognize this ship? My God, I haven't seen Lady Julian since the 3rd of June, 1790, when I embarked. I was with her for 11 months. We left from Portsmouth on the 29th of July, no, 1789. Then a month later, we reached Santa Cruz, then Rio de Janeiro, where we stayed for eight weeks, then sailed across the Atlantic for 50 days, and finally arrived at this hellhole. Well, that's interesting. Any comments on that special someone? Yes, I had two husbands and 21 children. My children! Cut! Any comments on that special someone? Yes, I had two husbands. Let's start from there then. Who were they? Their names were T. Carrigan and Jonathan Brooker. Shortly after I was in the New World, which you now call Sydney, I was sent to Norfolk Island on the 14th of February, 1788. When I arrived, on the 6th of March, I met Teague and had three kids before he left me on an expedition. Well, let's move on. Here's Jonathan. Mary! Oh, Jonathan. Oh, I, I missed, missed you, you so much. I love oh, you. I've I missed you. I love you so much. Oh, oh. oh I've missed you. <laughs> yes, between us we had 18 children. With a grand total of 21. Well, then here they are. <laughs> Yeah, so God, I love the time I spent with you at the farm in Campbelltown in 1816. And I remember our wedding in 1817. Ah, yes. I love that day. It was so great. I'm so glad I ended up stealing all those 200 pounds of glue to come here with you. Mm, yes. I remember we had to rebuild on several pieces of land because of those deadly bushfires. Oh, I hated those bushfires and I miss that house so much. <laughs> this is where your house went down, isn't it? That house. I oh, do I too. Miss it so I miss much. It. Oh. <laughs> I, do, I just love that house, but the 62 acres of land were more than enough. Almost as great as the time you died in 1833. And then later, at the age of 82, on December 17th, 1859, I died too. Well, that ended on a high note. Wow, that was some amazing footage. Please come back for next week edition for This Is Your Life. I'm so alone. This is your life.